Hello, my food. No, I took the fluffies off. Here's the kitty. Minzy? Minzy? Minzy. There you go. Look. Leave it there. Yeah, stay there. Good job. My food. I think it's a just quantity. Enough for me. Right now. Plenty actually. Oh look, no, it's it's a it's it's good. Not a lot. Could be less, but this is good. I'm gonna eat now. No, no one is on it. It's not good. I want to talk like this. It's dry. I wish I would have grabbed more and pick from the one. I think I'm gonna grab more from now and just to pick from it. It's not too good, it's dry. I mean, she loves me. When she talks love through her skin, I can feel it like like this. My hand on her or anywhere on the body, she talks love to me. I can feel it. How cool was that, right? Yeah, love, I don't know. She's also grateful. I can't go back, but I would do it because it's not really good. It's really dry. Like I said, if it wasn't, wasn't visible. Next time I'm gonna grab more, just to pick what I like from what is there. It's hard to see when it's all there in the pot. So I, I hope I will learn my lesson today. <laughs> yeah, I, I heard, I learned <laughs> that broccoli is good for me, so I eat broccoli. I like broccoli. It's, it's just what was there. No, they had red peppers in there, but I'm not sure. Sometimes I said it before. Red peppers are weird. When they're cooked, they release something, and I'm not sure about it. So, no. Okay, what is dry? It is probably the cut. Chicken breasts. I don't know the cut names, but that's dry too. And filet mignon is only good because it's close to the large bone, which actually gives out the porterhouse steak. So, because it's next to the bone, it's soft. Otherwise, yeah, it's yeah. Good. This is like the the tuna they sell, the they export from Mexico to the states, which is really white. It's also very boring. And in Mexico, the tuna you can buy in a can is not white. It's like darker in the skin, like dark red, and even much darker. And that's really yummy. <laughs> Weird. Now this looks like skin. I don't eat this, but they make like chicharrón out of this. I have tried it, I've eaten it, but I kind of I kind of lost that thing. I don't ever want to have that. Yikes. Oh! What's that? But my aunt gave her dog. <laughs> she cooked a meal. Good, Good girl. She ate her pork. Good girl. <laughs> Good. I probably did eat everything when I was a child because I was so afraid of my mother. But then again, did she give me exuberant quantities? I doubt it. Oh, wait, let's put this in here. Okay. Okay, on the top of my head. Now I'm preparing my dessert. What did I eat? So on the top of my head, so many little things. Lapskaus. That's canned meat. Is that like spam meat? Really yucky. With mashed potatoes mixed in one thing. I lose it. And what came with it was red beet out of a jar. No jar? Yeah. Yikes. I mean it's kind of neutral. Um cauliflower. That was like special day, an entire cauliflower came. Now I'm intending to find mine. I'm looking for my mine. Oh yeah, this. And that would be the special meal, and that would be the day we get a burger, a hamburger, cookie, piccadilly, and of course salt potatoes. Um, spinach. I love the spinach and bechamel. That I got with spiegel eye. I don't know why they're called sunny side up because they're always nasty in the in the states. The eggs. I like the egg yolk really soft and i don't know what they do with the eggs it's disgusting anyway that and salt potatoes 
Bratkartoffeln, of course, when the salt potatoes uh, on Monday, next morning or next day, it would be put in a pan with onions, probably egg, a little bit of bacon and stripes in it, all mixed up. And then on the side, I got rollmops, which is a herring and rotabete again. I like rollmops, but the other thing, I don't. On the top of my head, on the top of my head. Not always, the, I think not always the jacket has the same person in it. On the top of my head. Now that she made salads, I was later when she wanted to make a family. No, she she took the whole white bowl, um, transparent bowl, and put the stuff for dressing inside, which was simple, like white vinegar. Not they don't even use olive oil. The shit, so <laughs> Germany. <sighs> Whatever. And herbs. She got herb in there, which she actually planted herself. That was a new thing later. Yeah, like right before I had to leave. Leber on the top of my head. I had a lot of leber, which is um, egano, which is liver. Cow liver, not chicken liver. This was cheap. So I had that. It came with onions, which I liked. Really fried onions. And apfel mousse, which is put, um, um, apple compote out of a jar, of course. Nothing made home. And mashed potatoes, but out of a package. My favorite dish was tuna fricassee. That was like very seldom. And there we had a rice out of a package too. Imagine a plastic bag in a boiled water. How disgusting. And that would be chicken. But she would get the chicken out of a can and I had to take it out of there. Because she was disgusted by that. Chicken out of a can. And a can of peas and a can of probably champignons. And then she made bechamel out of that. That was like the highlight of my life, that food. Okay, sometimes we had cutlet. I think that's pork with the bone in it. But we had plenty of fish. And fish, mainly she bought chalet. That's a very flat, dark, large fish, even from the boat, which is disgusting. To me, it's disgusting. I knew how to do the fish, how to eat fish with Gretchen. Since I was a child, I had to learn with two porks. Because it's so bitter, I don't like it. I don't think we ever had trout. I don't know if we had any, I don't know if we had herring, maybe, from time to time. But she was like so delighted buying this dumb ass scholle. Yikes. What came with it? Nothing? I don't remember. Nothing? Oh. <sighs> 